G'day team, Petey checking in uh, with another unboxing. This time we've got a um, pretty cool new pen. I think it's um, um, one I've been looking at for a while. I always love um, these kind of tactical pens. So we've got, it's the Boca Plus. So it's just like a matte finish cardboard. It's pretty solid. Uh, so this is the model. Rocket pen brass in yellow. Same markings here. So it looks like it is a flip box. Yeah, that's a pretty cool box actually, and looks like that is a magnet. It is. That's pretty cool. So what do we get? Safety, blah blah blah. Um, so we got some kind of tag card. Amazing. Right, eh? So that is book limited lifetime warranty so that's pretty cool A little pamphlet we've got some troll pellets and then we've got the actual pen so it's set in this kind of high density foam a little cut out there so you can take it out and let's see this um, snap lock bag so let's have a look this is pretty weighty um, I saw a couple of reviews and I didn't realize that it was um, oval shape so that's pretty awesome Look at that. Awesome, like it's a machine kind of finish. Got minimal branding, which I really love that. I think this is a stainless steel clip. I'm keen to see if I can um, chuck that off. And then it's got the actual bolt slide mechanism. I've seen a few dudes who actually put like a bit of grease or something in there to free it up, but that feels pretty good. Uh, I think this holds like Parker style, maybe Fisher Space. So yeah, that's pretty pretty smooth movement. That's a ripper, and it's got a just ridiculous torque screw to get in the back. Apparently, you have to undo that to change the actual pen refill cartridge. That one there looks pretty chewed out actually. Like it's stripped, but I'm not too sure. I'll have to have a go at that. Because generally these come with a black ink cartridge, and I always prefer to write in blue, old style. That feels really nice to hold. That oval definitely makes it easy to sit in your hand and doesn't really spin around, so it's a bit easy to grab and then do a bit of writing, so let's give that a crack. Sweet. Oh, it's got like a nib cover, plastic thing. That's on there pretty well. Yep, there it goes. What is this? So testing. Oh, it writes well. It definitely holds nice. Um, Boca Plus Rocket Pen. So my writing's shocking. I don't always have to write in capitals, but these make it definitely easier for me. And with the weight, you don't have to push down as hard. 
So I'd say I'm very happy with that. Um, the fit and finish on it's pretty cool. You can see that's got like some knurling machining in there, which is um, interesting. Maybe it gives it a bit of grip. You can see that it's got some notching on that bolt just to grab, make it a bit more grabby. It's a pretty light spring. It's definitely enough to keep it there. Well, I think that could be <coughs> a new favorite to add to the addition. Yeah, that's um, an absolute ripper. I'm pretty happy with that. Definitely keen to see if I can get that clip off. I don't know why they didn't make that in brass. Probably because it's maybe bends or something. It doesn't bend as well. I think that would have been better in black. Just painted black, whatever. And maybe I think I'll definitely do a spray job on that if I do keep it on there. Yeah, that's an absolute ripper. I've also seen, well, I've heard on forums that guys will sand this back so it gets a bit more of a patina. I reckon that's a pretty cool idea as well. Anyways, team, I think um, that's definitely a win. Um, and that's one that I, I definitely recommend. Baker Plus. What a ripper. Righto team, I hope you're having an awesome day.